This video is brought to you by my sponsor Controller Mods. If you want the best quality custom PlayStation or Xbox and Xbox Elite controllers to your own personal design and taste, check them out. Their website is linked at the top of that video description. Use code DPJ for 10% off. What is going on guys? Today I am back with another Destiny 2 video and today I have for you guys this amazing chest experience. Blight. Now the other day I posted this very same position but this version is miles miles quicker. But before we go any further guys, uh, if you do enjoy the video leaving a like really does help me out and if you want to be in with a chance of winning one of my Rockstar Destiny 2 in-game exclusive gear codes, simply drop a like on the video and leave a comment down below. Okay so open up your director, head to Nessus, you want to come down to Exodus Black, the landing zone and you want to spawn in right here. Okay, so once you've spawned in, you want to follow the direction I take. Now, chests, what can you actually get from them? Well, you get Glimmer, you get Shaders, you get Planetary Tokens, you get XP, so the more you farm, the more the XP you'll get, meaning you'll get Bright Engrams, you can also get Legendary Engrams, so there's quite a lot you can actually get from these things, including armor as well, like blue, rare armor. So, yes, so you want to follow this cave route I am taking, and you'll end up in this room here with these Vex, enemies now we'll get rid of these but it ain't really important but i just want to show you guys where these actual chests can spawn in um okay so let me just get rid of you as well so okay so one can spawn there it can spawn there which is where it is it can spawn there it can spawn up here it can spawn in this very cave right there and it, well that gladly just went for that teleport picked up that chest but that isn't really important anyway and it can spawn right there. Now once you actually find a chest, this is what you need to do. Let's say for instance it's in this corner. So you want to pick up this chest, as you can see by this footage I recorded earlier. So you want to pick up this chest and make your way through this teleporter. You want to jump up, jump on your sparrow, go down to the chamber of light. You'll see it load up in the bottom left hand corner of your screen. Once it loads up, you want to turn around and head straight back and go straight to that chest you just picked up. And here's where it gets uh, really important and you have to time this. And once you get back to the chest and you've picked it up, you want to stay with the chest until it disappears. As soon as it disappears, you want to count to about a minute, a minute 20 seconds. But while you're doing this, um, you want to get out of the area. You can take out the Vex enemies within this actual cave system if you want to before you go through the teleporter. But as soon as you do that, get out of the area and go down to the Chamber of Sky area and wait here for about 40 seconds. You need to be a minute total away from where this chest area is. Uh, so you go back and a fresh new chest will have spawned in this area. It's as simple as that. You pick it up, you make your way through the teleporter, go down to the chamber of night as fast as you can, come back to that very same chest, pick it up again, uh, then you wait for it to disappear and again you count a minute and 20 seconds while you're getting out of the area going down through the teleporter to the chamber of sky and just rinse and repeat you can get about three chests per minute minute and a half here so it's pretty pretty easy it seriously is i mean like what can you complain about it's the fastest way by an absolute mile of getting chests and getting all these planetary tokens engrams and so forth within the game so yes guys it's the same version as what i posted the other day just miles miles quicker and a lot more consistent but guys i hope you enjoyed the video thanks as always for stopping by i'll put instructions on screen now if you're unsure of what to do also i will put them within the video description uh, but yes if you're new around here and enjoy daily destiny videos be sure to subscribe if you never want to miss a video i upload hit that bell button next to that subscribe button to receive email notifications of when i do upload but thanks as always for stopping by and i hopefully will see you on that next one
getting right.